now you know everything here this was what we derived in the maybe before in the beginning of the example now we know that a s w by s minimum is this one 0 0.3 right and we know that a s max is calculated with this minimum clear i hope if a s w by s is minimum so the s that you will get from this will be s maximum easy now this is this gives me 335.1 i will take 330 again s max the one that we used last in the previous slide 0 0.75 g so the maximum spacing is again 337 here it is 335 here it's 337 here both of them gives me 330 now this will be the maximum spacing that i will have now what i should know is where should i start this spacing let me continue now we know that the distance from the center up to this end will be up, up to this midpoint will be three meter now with this asw by s equals this as per the formula now we want asw by s minimum right s is now 330 asw is now to be two legged phi eight now this z is now this everything is now except vrds if you use s max you have to determine the v that will develop this ratio to be the minimum now this means what this okay for the minimum to be this ve must be the minimum okay the minimum can be by rearranging this and so as will be two uh five eight bars divided by s max is 330 and times this 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 finally i will get 106.22 once i get this i have it means that i have this now i can determine this by similarity of triangle i know this is 225 by 3 will be equal to 106.22 by l which i don't know so by with this similarity of triangle i can simply find l to be equal to 1.416 so i better take 1.4 because if I take 1.5, maybe I will go into the location where shear stirrups are, uh, uh, where the minimum may not work. Okay, the minimum will work starting from this point and inward here, in the to, to the right. But to the left, 190 millimeter spacing will be used. So I better take a less value than this one. So this gives me L equals 1.4. So for this, uh, this means this mid part is 1.4 times 2. So I will start from this up to here. I will have 2.8. So the remaining part will be 1.45 here and 1.45 here. Now, if I, if you check what I said previously, that is L over 4. L that we have is 6 meters. 6 meters over 4, it is 1.5. So it's almost 1.5 even 1.5 is better okay so l over 4 most of the time works however you may check it always when you are dealing with this so the number of bars can be calculated at the end i have 1.45 divided by the spacing plus one i have nine and at the mid span i will not add one because already the reinforcement from here is here and the reinforcement from here this side is here so directly dividing it and i will get nine bars and finally i have this kind of reinforcement nine pieces five eight at 190 millimeter and here nine pieces five eight at 330 millimeter the dimension from here up here is two times 1.4 it is 2.8 meters okay so finally this kind of detailing will be provided at the end i hope this was uh, clear and interesting if you have any questions don't forget to ask me on the comment box or as you wish on my telegram or my uh, my whatsapp okay thank you for following up to here uh, i hope you enjoyed the lesson see you next time this is the end of class two